Hey, good night, beautiful people. Just want you to have something to think about, and you can go in and fast it and pray about it. Why do so called men of God cover their heads with either a hat, a bandana, a band to cover their foreheads? Did you ever think why they cover their foreheads? How come they're covering their foreheads? Well, do you know some people's spiritual eyes are open, right? So, and some people have the seal, have a light in their foreheads, right? Some people have light around them. The real children of the Most High have light. But the workers of Satan do not. And they know some people's spiritual eyes are open. So they cover their foreheads because people would see that they don't have any light in them and that they're false prophets. Children of God have a seal on them. All right? The evil people want you to believe that they're the children of God. I told you many shall come in his name in the last days and shall deceive many and fool many. So you got the star of Moloch they use on you and they got the headband covering their forehead, covering the seal, the light that's on children of God. All right, so I just want you to understand and go in a prayer about this because that's why they cover their heads. That's why they wear a hat. That's why they wear a ban. And they talk about, we're not covering our heads. You're covering your head. It's an abomination for a man to cover his head. Real men of God don't cover their head. Any person with any real spiritual knowledge and they're a man, you'd never see them with their head covered at any time. So you have to know, who set up these people in the last days to deceive the house of Israel? Who set them up? Who were? Why did a flood of camps just come out at the same period of time for the past, what, six, seven years? Understand that because the time is close. Satan knows he has but a little time left. So he is trying to deceive as many as possible. Be careful and just put the Most High God as your guide. Christ as your guide. You understand me? Go to the Father for everything. And that's all I can say to you. I love you guys so much. I pray for you all the time. I've been in this fight and I pray for things that I know you guys don't even understand yet. But I pray that you get there. And I pray that he blesses you with all knowledge, with spiritual knowledge, wisdom, and understanding. And, you know, and a humble heart. Because the devil wants people to be proud and puffed up. But I hope you have a great evening and you think about what I said to you. You have a great day. Have a great evening, I mean. Hallelujah. Bless you.